What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Not really doing anything crazy car related today besides taking dope ass photos with Brandon Kwan right here. He's a uh, founder, right, Rare Breed? Founder of Rare Breed. Hit me up, he was like, yo, the consides look fucking sick on your car, let's do a shoot. I was like, down, let's make it happen. We we're supposed to shoot tomorrow, today's Saturday by the way, we we're supposed to shoot on Sunday, but the weather today just kinda worked out really, really well. So we just kinda last minute, I was like, yo, let's just fucking shoot today. The weather's amazing. The low light's just gonna make the car look incredible, which as you guys can see here, it looks pretty damn good. Because it was so last minute, the car's a bit dirty. You wanna tell him what I just did? <laughs> you, got the, you got the Walgreens special on this car right now. Walgreens special? Yeah, you did, you did some 409 cleaner up in there later. I mean, it was just, just a little bit. Just like, I didn't have a spray bottle of water. Yeah, 408 cleaner. 408? Yeah, I sprayed 409 on some parts of the wrap. I hope it doesn't deteriorate. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Is that a dumb move? Or is it okay? I don't know. Maybe you guys know more about using 409 on it. I just did some research. It doesn't seem like it's bad, but it just means wrap your car satin black. That's what it means. <laughs> the man himself working his magic. Bam. So we just finished up at this spot. Uh, we're headed to the next spot, with it, which is a parking garage, parking structure next to like a really nice all glass building. Spent about like 25 minutes here at this spot. Um, shooting cars is pretty, pretty fun. Pretty quick process too, if you know what you're doing. Brandon, he's a really, really, really great photographer. If you guys are from the Bay Area, San Jose. If you have an opportunity to shoot Brandon, fucking take that shit, dude. Take some really clean photos. If you guys go to his website, um, I'll have the link in the description below. I think it's just rarebreed.com or something like that. He runs a blog um, and takes really sick photos of people's cars. He also shoots for Stance Nation as well. Have you seen any of Brandon's work? Oh yeah, of course. Yeah? Freaking getting into the car scene, I always saw Rare Breed stuff and the Stance Nation photos. Oh yeah? So it's just kind of like, the, all his photos are really good. Check it out guys. I don't know if you guys recognize this spot. I've shot here before. I took Brandon here. Brandon, is your first time here? You've been here before? I've been here. Oh, you've been here before? Yeah. I guess this is a pretty well-known spot now to take photos for your cars. Actually, not just that. Actually, we ran into a family um, that was in a Subaru. They were up here. It was the only car up here. So I went I'm thinking it was security. I was like, yo, maybe I'll just talk to security. Maybe it'll be chill and take photos here. And everyone's happy. Turns out it was just some really, uh, really nice, 
family. And they were like, yeah, we're just taking photos up here too, man. Have fun. I was like, hey, sick. Huh, I didn't know carbon fiber peels off like that. That is strange. Yo, how much you get this car for, Brandon? <laughs> Damn, dude. I need to check out that dealer you went to. Lucrative Co. Dealership? You already know. Don't run over any nipples. Damn, bro. I just asked Brandon to drive my car around the parking lot just so I can look at it and get footage of it. So just, I love to tell up the RPMs and go to the Well, I mean, maybe not that. I mean, they probably won't suspect it's us because, you know, there's a lot of fucking tire marks here, but... Bruh. Thing looks fucking crazy. It sounds so good, too. Oh, he ran over a nipple. I don't know if you guys know that reference, but I mean, for all the OGs, like in the car scene for a long time, uh, there was this video like way back of this guy named Vin who was part of Royal Origin. And he was like letting some guy learn how to drive stick in his red hatch. And he's, they made a funny reference about running over a nipple. So, hey man, new generation's coming in. I'm just gonna steal that reference from Royal Origin. Nut. I wish I could see this thing move more often, bro. I'm so jealous of everybody else who gets to see it. <laughs> just dump the clutch, Brandon. I'm just kidding. <laughs> He's not, he won't do it. I wouldn't care, but you know, huh? Oh, you don't know how? Okay, then, then don't, don't do it. Damn, that's so sick. I could watch this all day. So honestly guys, in low light, the purple's not too bad. I can kind of bear with it when it's like low light, but when there's a lot of light out and it's like super metallic-y or color shifting, I just can't handle it, man. Okay guys, and Kansai, please don't get mad, but yeah, that happened. Yeah. I let Arlen drive, that's why. <laughs> I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just playing. <laughs> hey, what? I was like, that's some disrespect right <laughs> I, know. I know, that was all me, Arlen didn't do that. <laughs> uh, he would, Arlen would never allow himself to do that. It was actually Brandon. You guys saw him driving earlier, right? <laughs> I'm just kidding. It was all me. Fuck, I'm so the ashamed. The whole purpose of, of Christian's vlog today was so that he could blame somebody for curbing his wheels. Exactly, bro. No evidence for it. Exactly. So <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding, dude. Watch out, Brandon. You're gonna get a, you're gonna get a mail from from the like from the California Supreme Court or something like that, and they're just gonna be like, Christian Noah sued you for curbing his consigns. <laughs> Yo, guys. So I gotta say, the photo shoot couldn't have been any more perfect, to be honest. Like the lighting, pretty solid. Yeah, really good. Everything turned out good. Fucking this spot, no security. It's just us up here and this 
big ass open lot, which which means I should fucking swing it up here, dude. Like 20,000 likes, I'll fucking do a donut around that pole right there. Just kidding, I don't need 20,000 likes. I'm just gonna do it anyways. <laughs> just kidding. Nah, I'm not gonna ruin this spot for everybody else. That's fucked up. So Brandon's trying to figure out how I have so much angle on this Subi because I haven't told him the secret. Just like trying to figure it out right now. <laughs> What's up? <laughs> Dude, got any sleep last night on this flight. Oh yeah, why is that? You went got fucked up. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Everybody over here trying to find what I did, like what Bigfoot, where Bigfoot at. I know, dude. Everyone's like, yo, petition to find out what Arlen's talking about. <laughs> that shit was funny. Not bad, not bad. It's a lot of fun, but I still tried. <laughs> 